Look at me. Remember, no work, no beer. Oh, that'd be awful. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Mal, would you bring your brush over here real quick for me? What do you want? Your brush real quick? Yep. I thought these were uh, a little bit farther apart, but they're not. Would you catch that lower edge there, please? You see what I'm talking about? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. And for all that cutting, the, uh, the room is just so much nicer. Oh, I know. For sure. Yeah, I'm Well, it's, I don't like that edge on it, you know. I know. I did paint across the other side through the seam. No, no, I'm not talking about that, Mom. I'm talking about like when you uh, when you roll yeah. and you get this like edge here. Yeah. You got to go back over it. That's what I'm talking oh, about. Okay. Yeah. Well, you did a nice job on there, honey. Thank you. Oh, well, I just, uh, I had to hit a couple of your spots, too. It's just, you know, it's well, there's right. these, go one, two, three, four. Oh, I didn't get those yet, huh? Well, huh? I guess I'll have to get those. Yes, you will. Go ahead, go back. I'm so glad I'm out here instead of over there. Yeah. You know, with all that going on. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. It's much more peaceful here. Yes, it is. And it's going to stay that way. Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse One here. So, giving you an idea 
uh, what we're up to, obviously. So this building, and I got to still, I didn't realize I missed those couple spots up there, but I got to hit those. Um, we, cutting in this building, I will tell you right now, it absolutely sucked. It was not any fun <laughs> in any stretch of the imagination. So the battery room is going to be much easier because I just got to do some high cutting in. It's not, that's not a big deal. But I'm going to walk you on. Yes, hello, sir. Really? I know. I know. You're a good boy. All right, so I'm just going to kind of walk you around this. Because now I'm in the rolling phase. And that will take me no time um, to roll these. We got everything cut in here. We cut in all along the top of here. Uh, did the outside of here. On the back side, all up through, everything is cut in as well. As you guys can see, we got that all cut in. So like I said, the rolling part, and then the front, everything is cut in the front. There's a couple spots I can see up there, it's got to get touched up, but that's okay, we'll get that. Um, get this all rolled, I'm not worried about the inside. We're just going to get out through the outside because that's the weather, it's going to take the weather. So, this one will be completely done today. I'm not sure if, uh, so mom is working, if you can see, and I will kind of, oh, excuse me, hold on a second. I have to do my job. Yes, hello, sir. Yes, please, forgive me for being lax and not jumping to your attention. Um, so mom is staining the outside of the uh, greenhouse as well. And we're going with that same light brownish color. I really like the color of it. I think it's going to look really good. Uh, it's going to go with the property well. And uh, so she's working on that because that's low work. And it's, you know, for what she can do. So mom did all the low work on here as far as she could reach. I did the high work as far as cutting in went. And because she can't be on the ladders anymore. So I don't ever want her to do that. But um, so... We have, that's the main project we're working on today, and uh, so we'll, she'll get as much done of this as she decides to, and there's no, like I said, there's absolutely no rush, but uh, I'm going to probably wait till tomorrow and tackle this all at once and just do it in one shot tomorrow. So I'm going to finish up the battery room today and, uh, and go from there, but... Uh, Yes, I mean this here. The rolling part is going to be easy. It's just I got to get up in there and I got to cut everything all along under there, the whole nine yards. So uh, that part's going to not be a whole lot of fun. So that's what we're working on. So it's coming along. Into it. Let me show you the sky. It's absolutely gorgeous here today. Absolutely beautiful. Clear blue skies. It's uh, comfortable. I will tell you what the temperature is here in a second. It is 73 degrees today. So it's just absolutely beautiful here today. The puppies are relaxing. Uh, I think we have like one or two more days where it's going to be in the in the 70s. And then we hit a stretch where we're going to be in the 80s. So high 80s. So I wanted to get this painting banged out and done uh, before it got too hot. Because if you're sitting out here trying to do this when it's in the 80s, that's not any fun at all. So uh, that's our... our game plan and our motivation um, the babies the baby chicks are doing well over with the other ones and uh, everybody's good there so uh, just trying to take care of business and get things done and uh, but uh, you know like I said every, everything is if you just bang it out methodically uh, it is amazing it really truly is um, how fast things come together because now once we have this woodshed stained um, it's done, and, or not stained painted. Um, it's it's done, and we're going to be good to go. And uh, so I'm pretty happy about that. And uh, I'm looking forward to checking one more thing off of my list of things to do, which will be great. But uh, like I said, it's, it all comes together. It all takes time, uh, you know, just in the effort, realistically. And uh, so mom has been out here. So everybody's been asking. Um, is mom moving out here as well? Yes, mom is moving out here. What we're going to be doing when we put the addition on here, one of the rooms is going to be for mom. So uh, mom will have her own room, 
and she will be with me. And uh, so, and I told her she stays with me until she gets dementia, and then she's going to the nursing home. <laughs> Off you go. See you later. No, I'm only kidding. Now, we'll take care of mom here at home. Um, that's what we do with our family. We've done that. Um, mom took care of my great-grandmother Phillips, which was her grandmother. Uh, you know, she took care of her when uh, she was home. And we had four generations under one roof at one point in time. And uh, that was pretty cool. Looking back at it now as an adult, it was absolutely very, very cool. But uh, it gives you a lot more appreciation for family, uh, obligations, responsibility, <laughs> you know, all those things. But uh, that's how we roll. I mean, uh, we take care of our own. And uh, so I plan on having mom with me until uh, she decides to go take the big dirt nap. And, uh, you know, there she goes. So, but we're going to keep her around for a while yet. I'm not going at any time I was just going to say, we're going to keep you around for a while. I know people are actually amazed um, at 76 years old how you have that get up and go. And, uh, it's called never say die. Exactly. <laughs> it's, that, it's that stubborn determination that somebody inherited. I'm not too sure who that was. I have no idea either. That never, never going to, no matter what anybody says, that you can't get that done, you go, watch me. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's true. So, but uh, that's kind of how, it's, that, that's where I get it from, guys. Uh, stubbornness. It's that German Dutch that... Uh, is that pig-headedness, but uh, that's okay. That's it <laughs> it's all right. Hey, you know what? It's got us where we are in life, right, Ma? It works. Yes, it does. So, anyway, guys, I am going to jump off of here because I want to get back to work and I want to get this woodshed done. Um, and then, guess what I'm going to do? I'm going for a ride. <laughs> so, um, I hope everybody's doing well. I hope you're all having a good day. Again, guys, just continuously work at things, and it's amazing how much stuff gets done it really is uh you know just having that attitude uh not no quit attitude and you're going to get there so remember guys we are all in this together that is important to remember also remember to hug and kiss the ones you love tell them every single day tomorrow is not guaranteed we never know what's going to happen in life so it's really important that we tell the people that we love and that we care about every single day how we feel also remember guys std it's one step at a time one thing at a time and one day at a time Whatever you are trying to do, whatever you are trying to accomplish, you can do it. The only person that's going to stop you from reaching those goals and those dreams is you. That's it. Nobody else can stop you. Stay positive, stay away from that negativity, and you're going to be fine. All right? I will see you all tomorrow. Um, I hope everybody's having a great day. Uh, I don't know what my ultimate egg count is yet for today, so obviously I will let you guys know tomorrow. All right? Have a great night. Prepper Nurse One, out for now. Say goodbye, Ma. Bye.